Hello and welcome to Trust News Summary. I'm Darshan Husseina Usman. Now the news in brief. Economic and Financial Crimes Commission has arrested former Governor Abdulaziz Yari in connection with the agency's ongoing investigation of the suspended Accountant General of the Federation, Ahmed Idris. Yari, a former Governor of Zamfara State, was arrested on Sunday at his residence in Abuja days after he won the ruling APC's ticket for Zamfara West senatorial elections holding in 2023. Nigeria Center for Disease Control on Sunday said 66 suspected cases of monkeypox had been reported in the country between January 1 and May 29. According to the agency, 21 of the suspected cases were confirmed in nine states, while one death was recorded in a 40-year-old man with renal comorbidity and on immunosuppressive drugs. Meanwhile, National Agency for Food and Drug Administration and Control has approved two herbal drugs for COVID-19 clinical trials. NAFDAQ Director General Professor Mujisha La Dieye in a statement Sunday said three herbal formulations were approved for clinical trial studies during the COVID-19 pandemic. She said while two studies had commenced, including the IHP Detox Tea, a third clinical trial study is yet to start. And finally, rescue workers in Nepal have recovered 14 bodies from the crash site of a small plane that went down with 22 people on board. Spokesman for Nepal's Civil Aviation Authority, Dio Chandralal, on Monday said that the search for the others is continuing. There were 19 passengers and three crew members on board the twin Otter aircraft operated by Nepali carrier Tara Air when it went missing on Sunday. And with that, we've come to the end of Trust News Summary. Don't forget to follow us across all our social media platforms. I'm Darshan Husseina Usman. Thanks for watching.